Hi, my name is Michael and I'm with GoCRM and I noticed that you showed some interest in our software. So what I'm going to do today is show you how to get started with your 30-day free trial. All right, so what you're going to do now is you're going to go ahead and click on the Get Started tab and it's going to take you to a sign-up page. You're going to put in your team name, which would be your company or business, your basic information, first name, last name, your, your personal phone number, uh, your email, and a password, of course, that only you know. Go ahead and click on the register button and it's going to take you to a pricing page where it's going to explain to you where you get 200 free text messages, 200 free minutes, and one free local line. After that, you're going to be prompted to put in a debit or credit card. Don't worry, you're not going to get charged up front. After putting in your debit or credit card, we're going to go ahead and get redirected to your dashboard. If you look up over to the top right hand corner, you're going to see your name and then you're going to click on the phone button. You're, now you're going to see where you can select your phone number. So the first thing you need to do is put in the area code that you're calling from or want to be calling from. After putting in your area code, you're going to see a list of phone numbers. Once you see the one that you like, you're going to go ahead and click on get this. Now this number that you just selected will now become your new work or business number. Any phone call or text message that comes through this number will be logged and recorded. You will be able to make phone calls or send out text messages directly from your desktop or through your smartphone on your Android or iPhone app. Now what we're going to do next is go ahead and set up how you want your phone calls to be received. My recommendation would be to have it ring directly through the GoCRM app. And just in case you don't answer within 15 seconds, go ahead and forward it to your office number. If the call is forwarded to another number, you can enable Call Whisperer to identify that the call is coming from GoCRM. Once you've selected your preferences, go ahead and click on Update. Now what we're going to do is go ahead and sync your email. What this is going to allow you to do is send and receive emails directly from GoCRM. Now let's go ahead and click on Connect to Email. What you're going to do next is go ahead and click on your account or you might be prompted to put your email and password in. Now you will be redirected to GoCRM and you should see your email and status should be sync working. Now that your email is connected, let's go ahead and set up your email signature. I'm gonna go ahead and copy and paste mine, but you can also create one in our built-in editor. Once you've done that, go ahead and click on save and then the green button will enable your signature. And for the last step in setting up your new GoCRM account, we're going to go ahead and go to the notification tab. By default, all of your notifications will be on in your email. I highly recommend that you also turn on your mo mobile notifications. There you'll be able to see new tasks, new appointments, and new leads that are coming in directly via text message. Also, don't forget, if you need to change any of your personal information or your password, go ahead and click on the profile button. Go ahead and click on the GoCRM logo in the top left hand corner and that'll be your home button. And there you go, your GoCRM account is all set and ready to go. Now we're going to go ahead and add your first contact. First you're going to go ahead and click on the people tab and if you look over on the right hand side you're going to see add person, go ahead and click on that. Now go ahead and fill out your contacts information, first name, last name, phone number, email, etc. You can also make this form your own by customizing contact statuses and adding any additional fields. Go ahead and click on add once you've put in all the information and then you're going to visit your contacts profile by clicking on their name. Once in your contacts profile, you're going to be able to log all your activity with this person. You can make phone calls, send out text messages, send out emails, see your tasks, appointments, and even log a note with this person. Now let's make a phone call to our first contact. You can do this by selecting the make a call tab and then clicking on call now. Automatic voice message system nine five six two four zero. So it looks like my call didn't answer. I'm gonna go ahead and make a note and log the call. To make sure he doesn't forget to call me back, I'm going to go ahead and jump over to the send SMS tab. 
I'll then select my follow-up template and shoot him a text message. And to be extra sure that he doesn't miss me, I'm gonna go ahead and jump over to the email tab and send him an email too. And in just a couple of seconds, I called him, texted him, and emailed him. So what I'm gonna do now is set a task for myself to follow up with him. Let's go ahead and set it for two weeks from now. Oh, would you look at that? Our contact just reached out to us and he's ready to meet tomorrow. Now let's jump over to the schedule tab and set our appointment for tomorrow. Once you or your sales rep has made it to the meeting, you can use our mobile app to check in and verify their location as well as log notes. And there you have it. We invite you to explore your 30 day free trial with GoCRM and take advantage of our many other features that include automated text message and email follow up, drip campaigns, email marketing, smart lists, call tracking and website integrations. And if you would like to set up a one on one free training with me, please don't hesitate to reach out. Thank you.